pulling. <laughs> that was <laughs> cool. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Like everyone else, I struggle with falling on trad. So I decided to face this problem head on and work on my being comfortable taking falls on gear. Obviously, rock climbing is a dangerous activity and blah 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 blah. Yeah, just keep in mind that it is your responsibility to stay safe out there, no one else's. And you cannot blame anyone else for any of your actions. <laughs> Let's try and have fun this time. <laughs> I mean, it's not like I did not have fun the first time, I just like, I was so scared. There's more type 2, you're trying to get it back into type 1. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something like that. Okay, dude. All right. Not looks good. Um, I think this is how you use a Grigri. Great way to develop trust in your gear is placing gear and hanging on it at ground level. The great way about this is that gear works the same on the ground and off the ground so you can not really get hurt and you can uh, develop the trust in your gear placements. <laughs> that was like 50% of your weight. You ended up placing something here, didn't you? A, bit, a little bit higher, the, uh, the point three went in really nicely. It's the blue one. Yeah. If you've got this step down and by Having this down, I mean, you're comfortable and you're breathing normally and whatnot while you're hanging on your piece of pro. Try pushing out with your legs, just like as if you were up sailing. You want to take? Oh, hold on, I'll just scope it out. Yeah. I'll probably still hold on because I'm. All right, take a bit more. That's right. You need to persuade your mind that if you place a bomber cam and sit on it uh, when you're 10 centimeters off the ground, it's gonna work the same when you're at the crux of your project. Please, please, please do not hesitate to back things up. That could be placing one or two more pieces or if you want to go further, you could set up top rope with a second belayer to be on a completely separate system. I want something to back this up even though I was like sitting on it earlier. Yeah. It's a little too tight actually. Yep. Cause I'm still like not super comfortable like taking falls on this. Wow, yeah, that, thing, that thing's not going nowhere. Yeah. It ain't going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> I think I might try like take a little fall on it. Alright. <sighs> Pulling. <sighs> yeah, that's alright. Yeah, you're not. Oh no. Did you get hit? To the nuts, buy a nut. <laughs> that sounds miserable. <laughs> <laughs> Alright dude, climbing. I might take a one take a one more. Alright. <sighs> yeah. Oof. I got stepped on the rope. Yeah, not quite as comfortable as the first one. No? No. I mean like in my head, like this, the catch was all right. Yeah. Another really important thing is to talk to your mate. Are the catches soft enough? Are you falling too far? If something's not right, you better tell them. You know what I just noticed? I still have my f***ing VA glasses on. If they're not aware of the problem, they cannot help you. If you're honest, you can quickly develop trust in each other. And having a climbing partner you can trust is probably one of the best things for your climbing. Just take one more fall, yeah? Yeah. 
Ha. Huh. That was nice. Thanks for the catch. Uh -huh. Tried to make out a little softer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it did feel quite nice actually. Thanks. All right, take. Falling. <laughs> <laughs> that was f***ing cool. <laughs> yeah, nice. Did it fall a bit further than I was expecting to? 